Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Primedia TV. I'm your host, Primedia TV, and welcome back to Nerd, not Nerd News, Late Night News. Our top story of the day is some allegedly groundbreaking uh, regulation coming in from the Biden administration, but we'll get into why that's probably not going to be a thing, but after some headlines first. Tampa Bay hasn't been hit directly by a major hurricane since 1921, and Hurricane Milton may be the one. Donald Trump said, uh, suggests that undocumented immigrants who commit murder have bad genes. He's using racial science. And Trump vows to remove Jew haters if re-elected during an event commemorating October 7th. And this includes Jewish Democrats. And on to our main story of the day. Biden set ten year, sets 10-year deadline. Force U.S. cities to replace lead pipes, the president to announce in Wisconsin an EPA rule aimed at ensuring drinking water is safe for all Americans. A decade after Flint, Michigan, water prices raise alarms about continuing dangers of tap and lead in tap water. Joe Biden setting a 10-year deadline for cities across the nation to replace their lead pipes. The president is expected to announce the final EPA rule on Tuesday in the swing state of Wisconsin during the final month of a tight presidential campaign. So I'm going to say why this is this might not matter. And I'm going to say why. And so uh, Trump's Supreme Court overruled Chevron. Chevron was a rule that basically made it, uh, basically said that courts should defer to the expert to experts. Experts in this case being federal agencies, which is, you know, places with all of the people whose jobs are to know how certain uh, actions impact communities the country and you know consumers the epa's job is obviously to protect the environment and and and, and maintain um you know the ecology of the united states and trust for future generations and because chevron was overturned by trump's supreme court um as nice as this 10-year deadline is it's up to like judges can a, a biased judge who doesn't think you know environmentalism who thinks environmentalism is woke or something can just say fuck you and not and, and like rule against it if somebody tries to sue against having this implemented so if like a city tries to fight against having to rip up all of its pipes and replace everything A, a, a friendly judge to that position can just do it. So there, there needs to be, you know, there needs to be a codification of the of that level of, you know, um, of that judicial deference in law. And I don't foresee this Congress be playing the one to do it. Um, the only way that would happen is if there was a, a Democratic blowout. And even then, like, it depends on the type of Democrats who win. If it is, you know, a more like a your AOCs, your Jabal Bowens, your Nina Turners, that's one thing. But I don't count on it, unfortunately. Hey, thanks for watching. If you want to, you want to talk to me outside of this video, outside of live streams, or just be a join the community and be a part of it, you can do so at hibmedia.gg slash discord. Discord link's there. We'd love to have you. And given the financial situation of the economy right now, I know this is a tall ask, but if you have the scratch to, to spare, please consider donating and becoming a supporter at hibmedia.gg slash tip. All of our perks are serviced through our Discord channel, including early access videos, exclusive videos, and more. Your generosity is a blessing and a dollar a month is included to my bank account. Thank you so very much for watching. I appreciate you and have a great day.